What is going on guys? Sports 15 here and today I am so excited to bring you guys MLB 14 the show road to the show So this is gonna be the creation and the first showcase game as you can see here We are starting up our second baseman road to the show a lot of contact a little bit of power a little bit of fielding and a little bit of speed Those are my five flex points. I decided to uh, make my uh, player uh, off by scratch not choose an MLB or in this year's game you can create yourself or model yourself after an MLB player which is really really cool I was thinking of modeling myself after Robinson Cano because he plays my position swings the same way um, and plays t sort of the type that I wanted to but I kind of wanted to start from scratch and uh, do it my own way but you can see here we are going to be making our second baseman Mark Banks he's gonna be our main road to the show for this year and uh, I'm really excited to bring you guys a uh, road to the show it's been a while since I've played MLB um, it's been a while since I've uploaded MLB and uh, I was going to upload a quick inning game, one of those uh, quick pitches or whatever, where you start with a count. I think it's called Quick Counts. I played one of those with the Blue Jays. It just really wasn't an interesting game. I think I won 10 nothing against the Yankees. Um, but I was going to bring you guys that yesterday, but I didn't have enough time to edit it, and it wasn't that interesting. So I, didn't, I decided not to bring that for you guys. But we have this Marks Banks Road to the Show. Um, this episode is just the creation and the first showcase game. I'll explain to you guys what showcase is um, once we get later into it. But uh, also, I'm probably going to be doing a pitcher road to the show. Let me know if you guys want to see either a uh, closing pitcher or a starting pitcher. Le leave that in the comments. That's probably going to be my other road to the show. And then uh, for the time being, I might do Diamond Dynasty. I don't know. I haven't checked it out uh, in full yet. But my main thing that I normally do in MLB is franchise. And I'm definitely going to be waiting for the Operation Sports rosters because right now, there are barely any rosters out um, and none of them are good. And obviously, you can trust the Operation sports rosters um, so those are the best ones always so I'm gonna be waiting for those they said it should be about a month around the ps4 release date but I'm gonna be playing on ps3 so uh, we are going to have to wait for the rosters for that but in the time being we can play road to the show and diamond dynasty those are probably the two two or three series that I'm gonna be doing it depends on what you guys want to see let me know if you want to see some diamond dynasty um, probably won't go too in depth with that but uh, maybe we'll try it out a little bit later but now let's get into this you can see we're just creating a lot of stuff um, one of my favorite things in uh, the creation mode for a uh, road to the show player is all the accessories you can have uh, you can check out all the accessories that I have and also the uh, facial hair you can have that's also really really interesting um, always is basically all the creation stuff is the same this year um, I think they might have added a couple more accessories I'm not exactly sure maybe like new shoe types or something and uh, but basically the rest of it I usually just go with like a generic looking type guy and then throw a beard on him to make it look pretty cool and then throw a bunch of accessories on him. usually go with the three-quarter sleeves and everything so he looks pretty cool and then the baggy pants so pretty much all this stuff is the same as uh, last year but there's a lot of different stuff this season such as the uh, rookie showcase which I'm gonna be bringing you guys here so uh, you can see my uh, my uh, batting stance is gonna be Jose Bautista at least to start I usually mix it up a bunch uh, over the course of it and uh, you can see all the personalized swing and stuff you can do one-handed or two-hand follow through your walk up your uh, practice swing your stride take pitch uh, take pitches for strikes you're swinging a miss and your home run celebration all those are pretty cool but uh, yeah basically the uh, rookie well not the rookie showcase just the showcase is basically you're coming out of college and uh, you basically play three games to get scouted to see which round you're gonna go in or what team you're gonna go to for the MLB draft so you basically play three games I'm gonna bring you guys one game in this episode and then probably the next two in, in the next episode possibly today depending on if I have enough time to make that but uh, basically you play three games and then you get scouted and drafted depending on how well you do and uh, you get drafted to a team you can decide to sign with them or you can go back to university or junior college or something and uh, come back in a couple years obviously your player does get older but you do get more training points and you get a better chance of getting drafted obviously because you have more training points and uh, a little bit more experience to get drafted so you see you start off with 500 skill points as always but stuff does cost a lot more right now I did get the pre-order bonus uh, from EB games 
basically GameStops if you guys are from the States. Uh, so I did get the pre-order bonus, um, but I don't know if I'm going to use it on this player or my pitcher. Uh, I haven't decided on that exactly, but you can see we're getting into our first showcase game. So basically, after we uh, play these three showcase games, then we have the decision to sign with the team or uh, or go back to college. It's not really going to depend on how well I do in the draft, depending if I'm going to sign with the team. It's just basically what team I go to because I don't want to play for a team like the Astros, obviously. I want to play for a good team that uh, really doesn't have that player at short at second base that uh is a really stud player so there's a bunch of options out there we'll see where we get drafted but uh, i really like playing second base at on defense it's a really fun position to play you guys should try it uh, i decided to try it for this year and uh it's been a lot of fun just to start here so you can see our first at bat here oh two count in the top of the third and we get struck out on the change up there so basically a bunch of no-name players we're playing against because these are all generated uh by uh, by mlb but right here with our second at bat 0 2 count runner on first chance to drive him in with a gapper and here we go deep fly ball to center field that one's going to be tracked down by the center fielder so here in our first uh showcase game we are already 0 and 0 for 2 but we've been playing stellar defense you don't always have to uh play that well on the hitting side of the ball to get drafted high it's all about making the right plays in the right time like that right there really brought my uh, draft stock up just because i made the right play made good reaction and made a good throw over to first but right here with a fresh count here first batter of the inning against a tough lefty and we gap one we pull one into the right center field gap we're going to be heading for second base and we're going to get there without a throw from the cutoff man get in there standing up take a hard turn for third but we do end up going back so a nice gapper there makes us one for three on the day and batting in that ninth spot i think we are in this game we are not going to get too many at bats i think we only had the three but right here ground ball to second base we're going to toss one onto short not a strong enough throw by the second baseman and and that's basically going to do it for this game. Those are all the clips from the first game. And if you guys want to see more of this, definitely leave a like. We do go on to lose the game 8-0, even though I had that gapper. But that's going to do it for this episode, guys. If you want to see some more, leave a like. Leave a comment on what I've talked about and everything. And I'll see you guys in the next one.